In this video, I'll be helping you with the Alex topic called solving a word problem using a system of linear equations of the form ax plus by equals c. Looking at the problem situation, it says one month Elsa rented two movies and three video games for a total of $21. The next month she rented four movies and eight video games for a total of $53. Find the rental cost for each movie and each video game. From the description we're told that we're going to have a system of linear equations and it's going to have this form ax plus by equals c. The two things that we're asked to find is we're asked to find the cost of each movie and the cost of each video game. So looking back at that first sentence one month Elsa rented two movies and three video games for a total of $21 I'm going to set my variables at m, which is the number of movies rented, and v, the number of video games. And then from that first sentence, Elsa rents two movies and three video games for a total of $21. So two movies, so that would be two times the cost of each movie which is M, plus three video games, so three times the price of each video game, equals the total that she spent that month, $21. So that is our first equation. From the second sentence, it says that the next month she rented four movies, so that would be four, times the cost of one movie and eight video games so plus eight times the cost of each video game and her total this month is fifty three dollars now that we have our two equations that form a system of equations two equations and two unknowns we can go back and do either elimination or substitution and for this example, I'm just going to use elimination. So I can eliminate those first terms, the 2m and the 4m, if I multiply this top equation by a negative 2. That would give me a negative 4m and allow those to cancel out. So just moving this down, if I distribute that negative 2, that would be negative 2 times 2m, negative 4m negative 2 times a plus 3v would be minus a 6v and then negative 2 times the 21 would give me a negative 42. It's important that we distribute that to every term in the equation. We can now add these two equations and in doing so that first term is going to cancel out the 4m and the minus 4m. That's why we multiplied the top by minus 2. And the second term, 8v minus 6v, gives me a 2v equals 53 minus 42 is 11. And then we can divide both sides by 2 to get the v by itself. And we have v equals 11 divided by 2 is 5.5 or since we're talking about money five dollars and fifty cents so we have video games are five dollars and fifty cents but we need the movies as well so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take that price here for video games, 550, and I'm going to substitute it in any of the equations that we started with, either this green one or the red one. Since the numbers are a little smaller in the green one, I'll choose that one. If I replace the V here with $5.50, we would have 2 times M plus 3 times five dollars and fifty cents equals the twenty one dollars 
And from here we can solve for m by first multiplying to simplify this. So this is 2m plus 3 times 550 is 1650 equals 21. And then subtract that 1650 over to the other side. Remember we're trying to get the 2m by itself. The left hand side, the 1650s cancel, leaving 2m equals 21 minus 1650 gives us 450. And then lastly, divide by 2 to get the m by itself. And we have m equals 225. So m equals two dollars and twenty five cents. And if we wanted to check this we could substitute both of those values into either one of these two original equations and we would get a true statement.